Demons are real, and we are about the business, especially this time of year, of making sure that you do not turn to the Holy One. So, we are going to make you self-destruct. <laughs> Try, anyway. Hi, this is Pat with Pat's Two Cents. I want you to hear this video. This young, handsome man has gone through a lot of struggles and he decided to turn it into something that can bless other people. I want you to hear how he describes when he prays the mental attacks that happen to him from the demonic realm, how the demons try to infiltrate his thought process to interfere with his prayer life. Listen to this. I want you to hear how it begins, the struggle he goes through while in prayer, reaching out to God with all his might, and the triumph at the end. I want you to hear this because many of you, your biggest warfare is done in your mind. Many of you are being accused by the, by the enemy. He is called the accuser of the brethren. And he will tell you, you're never going to make it. God doesn't love you. God isn't thinking about you. He doesn't care. He, they will tell you all kind of lies. And this is a great demonstration of how to deal with those lies when you're right under attack. Listen to this as Rashad shares this video. Hey guys, I'm going to show you how the enemy likes to get in our minds when we pray to the Lord. Father God, I'm praying and I'm asking Lord for your help, your guidance. Guide me down that narrow path that leads to life, that leads to you. I've been struggling for so many years. I've been hurting. I've been praying over a decade is asking and asking for your divine intervention. And I've seen you move in mighty ways in my life. Gosh. But the issue is my life is still the same in so many ways. Yeah, we know. And I'm hurting <laughs> still and I feel so vulnerable and alone in my troubles, Gosh. in my trials. Jesus, I uh, need you. Uh, Please. Did you hear him? He's praying to God again. He's not listening to you. Look how long we've had you down for so many years and decades. We sent so many people your way. Why haven't you given up yet? We have the power to make your life miserable. So shut up before we crank up the fire in your life and make it worse. Do you hear me? Father God, I'm so sick and tired of these thoughts in my mind. They're so negative. It's like, it's telling me that you don't care and you don't love me because look at all the things that been allowed to happen. And I know, Lord, your word says that you love us. You gave your son to us and he died in our place. He shed his blood on Calvary. He loves me. I know he does. So I know anything other than that is a lie from the enemy. That's it. We're going to make it all worse. Later in the week. God... This week has been heavy. A lot of nights I spent up because I can't sleep. <laughs> My heart is racing. I feel like I have, I'm having a panic attack. Anxiety. Music to my ears. I'm waking up in the middle of the night afraid. I feel like I'm about to go crazy. <laughs> and I'm, this is the most lonely I've ever felt in my entire life. Complimentary of yours No truly. family, no friends. Yeah. This is getting worse. Yeah. <laughs> no one calls me. No one checks up on me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No one visits me. Mm -hmm. Why does it seem to have gotten worse? <laughs> I told you to shut up. That I was going to make things worse. And now look at you. In the worst state that you were in first time around. A few days later. God. These spirits are attacking me with fear, with worry, with doubt, with unbelief. 
worry. I'm being tormented. I'm being tortured with this. Lord, please, God, save me. I need <laughs> save your help. Me. Save me, God. Save me. If you don't show up, they're going to take me out. He's not coming. Please, God, save me. Please. Please, I'm begging you, God, please. Please, God, save me. I don't know what else to do, Lord. <laughs> I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do. This has been going on for so many years. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> oh, God. Why, God? Why, God, why? Because <laughs> he doesn't care about you. That's why. See, the best thing to do is to turn to sin. Do what makes you feel good. He don't care. I bet you right now he won't even show up. He's not gonna show up. <laughs> I am that I am. What? What is that? Is it him? Has he come to take us for a time? God? Jesus. Is that really you? Yes. It is I. I, I, I I've been waiting my whole life for this. I, I, I've been praying for so many years, and I, I've been wanting this, and I've been... Is it really you? God? I've always been with you this whole time. I've never left your side. I've heard every cry. I've caught every single tear. Every time you hurt, I hurt. I can feel it. Every experience you've ever had in your life, the good, the bad, the ugly, I've been with you. I experienced it with you. You were brought with a price. You are a part of me. You were created in our image. I knew you before I formed you in your mother's womb. Everything that has happened to you, I have allowed it to happen, to strengthen you, because one day I will use you to advance my kingdom. You will overcome, and you will conquer. You will trample over many serpents. You are going to cast out a lot of demons out of many people. Very powerful demons you will encounter through people, but you will overcome. Ye shall overcome. I have placed a gift in you. A gift that is so powerful and almighty. And you are going to shake up the kingdom of darkness. There are so many people in the future that I'm going to place in your life for you to help them. You have gone through all of these trials, these fiery trials, for a powerful reason. You are going to save a lot of souls. You are going to save a lot of souls. And I'm going to do it through you. So be strong, be courageous, do not be terrified, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. No, 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 don't tell him those things. No, we don't want to lose the grip that we have over here. We had it all these years. No, we're losing that grip. We can't take it. No, 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 no. He can't. No, no. ENOUGH! The time has come for you to be cast out, demon. See, I allowed you to stay there, so that you can do those things to him, so that you can strengthen him. You have fulfilled your purpose, and now you must go. Angels of the Lord, go and grab chains, and bound him from hand and feet. And cast him into outer darkness where there be weeping and gnashing of teeth. Oh my. I feel free. My mind, it, it feels clearer. I can think straight. All the negative thoughts, they're gone. I feel so light, like a feather. Wow, I never thought I could feel this way. 
thank you so much, God, for thinking this much about me, that you came down and saved me. Thank you for bounding up that demon and throwing him into outer darkness. Thank you so much, God. I'm going to do your will, God. I have no choice. <laughs> I owe it to you. Thank you so much, God. I pray that everyone that hears this, it blesses you. <laughs> God has saved me. He has set me free. He, he has, has set, set the, the captive, captive free. free.